If you're looking for cheap and reliable FIFA 15 Ultimate Team coins, visit MMOGA, link in the description. Hello guys, and welcome to episode 3 of my Napoli career mode. It's Bug Boy Bug Boy here, and we have to start off this video in a sad way unfortunately. Look at this, look at this letter. We've got an injury and it's for Christian Maggio, our right back, probably possibly one of our best players this season who are in form and he's out for two months. So that's just not good for us. But anyway, except from that, we're going to go straight to advance and find our next game. It actually is home against Chivo. I'm not sure how you say that, Chievo, Chivo, but I'm going to simulate it because I know they're not the best of teams. So let's go, and bam, oh, 4-0, what a win. So guys, if you haven't seen my episode before where we played Genoa away from home, and Juventus away from home as well, could you go and check that out please? Don't forget to like that video, and yeah. Back to this one. 4 0 win, that is great. Look who we've got to kick off the Champions League group stage. Real Madrid, the bosses of Spain. We're away from home. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, guys, so here's the Santiago Bernabeu. Look at the graphics, I'll let you see it for a little bit. There's a car park, and look at the lights in it. Look at the crowd. This is such a huge, important game. We've got, we've got, we've got to get something from this to, to start off the Champions League well. And unfortunately, I'm not using my best team. I've got to admit. In fact, I've got to say, I used a better team against Genoa than this, so it's a bit of a risk. But a lot of my players are really tired, so I can't do anything about that. And I'm not trying to... I will show you the team quickly. So we've got Ibarbo up front, Hamsik, Mertens, Insigne, but the wrong one. We're playing Insigne's brother. 63 rated, but he's a right winger. And he's got a decent pace, so I, I, was, I was eager to see what he's like. We've got Mikel and Guzman, Gulam, Zuma... Kulevali, I'm not sure how you say his name, Zuniga, I think, and Alves in goal. Let's go, guys. I'm sorry if I haven't already mentioned. Um, I am playing on world class, just to let you guys know. In case you didn't know, I did play my Southampton career mode on that difficulty. I think legendary, I'm not quite up there yet. But maybe in a few seasons' time, on myself not on youtube i may just be able to do that final push and try a bit of legendary so yeah if you ever reached about 10 likes on for one of my videos maybe i would try the next season on legendary i'm not sure but i just wanted to let you guys know insigne could you tell me whether this is insigne or insigne i'm not sure but anyway, here's Zuniga. Come on. Along the floor. Hamsik. Oh, no. I didn't expect the ball to run all the way to Hamsik. But when it did, the shot was poor and it just rolled into Casillas' hands. Oh, that was a good opportunity. But here's Ronaldo on the other end. Don't let him shoot. Oh, no. How unlucky can you get? No, that's why you can't Ren let Ronaldo in the clear. Diego Alves with no chance. And to be honest, before that piece of play, we we had a nice attack. But we can't let Ronaldo in that amount of space because that's just what he does. He punishes. So we're going to have to come from behind with 35 minutes gone. Let's see if we can. Is Bale... No, I failed to clear it. They might. This is how they might punish. So close from Benzema. 
and that is half time and we're one nil down so because of that we're going to make some substitutions probably bring on Inla bring off Hamsick as well he's looking tired and put the Insigne brothers together and see how they combine let's go ah go away yes good tackle Koulibaly here's Mikel then get it to Insigne yes go on go on son shoot what the hell was that just no 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 I'm just not saying anything Go on, Martins. Come on, Barbo. Yes, he's got through them. Penalty, yes! Thank you, referee. You're cool. And that is a bad tackle. It was fairly unnecessary. Barbo about to take the shot. And the challenge came in from behind, so... Come on, Martins. This is vital. You score this. Bottom right. Last time I went top left, so completely opposite. Bottom right. Yes. Oh, no. Get in. That was fine. I'm, I'm, I'm happy with a one draw away from home. Because this is against Real Madrid, remember. So if we can hold on to this, I'm going to go on ultra defensive and counter that. And I'm going to be happy. Come on, if they score now, that's just... No. No! Defensive mistake! Defensive alert! Oh hell no! No 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 no! Oh my word, why is Bale just screwed up that chance so badly? Just kick it, I don't care now. I don't give a... Come on, come on, come on! A Bobo! Yeah, what a tackle, man! Oh, giving away. Come on, just tackle! Get that out, get it out! Spam, spam! Yes! And there it is! One all, that's not bad at all. That is vital. Real Madrid probably thinking they could have got the win. It was very, very close in the end. And yeah, let's advance. So we've got another away game in the Serie A. So let's get into it now. Right, guys. So I played this game against Udinese. And I decided to do it a little bit different. What I'm doing now is I'm going to go through the match highlights with you. And yeah, just to rest my voice a little. So yeah, I thought it would be good for a change. So let's get into the highlights, guys. So this start bit is where you need to have an attack. And let's see what happens at the end of it. It happens quite fast, so be, be ready. It was a good shot from their player, but... Pulling a good save out of Diego Alves. So here you can see from the corner, Diego Alves saved it around the post. So Udinese got a corner, and this is what happened. So they crossed it in. Diego Alves came out to punch it out, and he missed it and hit the head of one of U Udinese's players and went in the goal. And. Here, Mikel gave away a silly penalty, and let's see if they scored it. I went bottom left, Di Natale went down the middle, 2-0 down. Here's an attack from Hamshik and a good save. So another shot from Hamshik and another good save. Another shot from Hamshik and another good save. And Di Natale's a foul, it's not really interesting. Neither is that. Higuain. Right here. Desperate for a goal. And there we go. Near post. Finesse shot. He's got one back. 2-1. Here's a challenge. Heavy strong one. And we have a corner kick now. What's going to happen? Koulibaly's going to do an awful header. Ayosin Perez here. 
to one two of Kailon. His Koulibaly. Nice poke through ball. And there we go. A use of Perez in 80th minute equalising. Good comeback, that is. And here we go. We have a final attack. Are we going to score from it? No. Great save. Maybe about the follow up. No. That is the game, guys. No, it's not. Oh. At that moment, third time lucky. Koulibaly making it 3 2. And we took home the three points. That was just an unbelievable, unbelievable comeback. I will show you the stats now, guys. I had three goals, 13 shots, 8 on target. That's domination. But anyway, quickly look at the people. Dina. Yuza Perez was our best player. But anyway, it's advanced, guys, and thanks for watching that. But anyway, guys, thank you for watching this episode of my Napoli career mode. If you enjoyed it, please finger blast that like button and subscribe as well. And I'll see you in the next episode. Goodbye.